So it's really interesting, you know, Axios is reporting this from uh, the uh, their morning newsletter. Uh, well, I guess it's probably also on their website, uh, Mike Allen's uh, thing. But he's reporting that media companies are now doubling down on politics because suddenly politics is the new thing. Ever since Trump was elected, everybody's paying attention to politics. Why? Because Trump knows how to put on a reality show. And TV loves reality shows. Why? Because they're cheap. You'll recall back in the, in the late 90s or early 2000s, there was a big writer's strike in Hollywood. And the TV networks, you know, they had contracts. They couldn't, they couldn't put shows on the air that weren't written by union writers. And the union writers had walked out. So what were they going to do? Well, the television networks invented this new genre, this brand new kind of television called the reality show, where they just bring, you know, either actors or real people in and they would, you know, uh, play things things out, whether it was dating games or whether it was how to take on your boss or whether it was, you know, it, it, there was just a whole bunch of, and, and some of them were just, hey, look at me, you know, Kim Kardashian and Paris Hilton and whatnot. All these, and I don't know if those came out of that era, but, but you get what I'm talking about. These reality shows were cheap to produce. You didn't have to pay writers. Uh, you know, the producers and directors didn't have that much to do. It was, it was simple. And uh, then the reality shows, once the writers were back, then they started actually writing for the reality shows, like Celebrity Apprentice or The Apprentice, uh, Donald Trump's two shows. And those shows were carefully scripted to make Donald Trump look like the wise, successful businessman that he isn't. And to make the people coming there as, you know, the eager supplicants who are going to learn a brilliant lesson and be so grateful when they're done. Well, what they discovered was, A, reality shows get great ratings. And B, they're super cheap to produce. And they've been looking for the new reality show. You know, what's going to be the, the new thing, right? They've tried all these things, sticking people on desert islands and, you know, who's going to date who and, you know, are they going to hop into bed and blah, blah, blah. And it's all kind of passe. Well, the new reality show is Donald Trump in the White House. And of course, it's starring a reality TV star who, you know, did this for 10 or 11 years and knows how to do it well. So uh, Axios is reporting the media company, companies are now doubling down on even more politics and they point out at a relatively low cost. And uh, they say in the last 90 days, politics has held steady as the number one most read category of thousands of member websites within the database of leading traf traffic. Cable news networks have seen record ratings. The Kavanaugh confirmation, for example, was Fox News' most watched Saturday primetime since the 2003 Iraq war. So expect to see a hell of a lot more of this stuff. The question is, is that going to in your benefit to Trump or is it going to hurt him or both? 